The price of the Pi coin is one of the most talked about in recent times and many people are eager to know exactly what to expect as price for the Pi coin. Because the coin is yet to be available to the open crypto market, it is almost impossible to point at a price as the price for the Pi coin. What many can do is to estimate and speculate based on some data or factors available. In this video, we will get closer to what the price of the Pi coin could be. We will take a look at the possibility of IOU price positively affecting the real price Pi network coin after mainnet launch. An important question to look is, should pioneers estimate the real price coin from the IOU price? At an all-time high of $330 on IOU trading, can the real price of the Pi coin hit this price after mainnet and how long could it possible take? I know you will like to know that. One more thing to consider is the negative and positive impact if Pioneers decides to sell off their coin at the launch of the Pi mainnet. Stay tuned as we dive into these topics. Subscribe to the channel, and give a thumbs up. Your support is most appreciated. I will see you after the intro. The Pi Network. A project shrouded in mystery, whispered promises of financial freedom, and a mobile app that lets you mine crypto, with a tap. But before you picture yourself lounging on a beach of pie-colored sand, there's a crucial detour to navigate, the IOU trading zone. Imagine a bustling marketplace, but instead of juicy mangoes and handcrafted pottery, they're trading slips of paper promising future deliveries of, well, something. That something is the actual Pi coin, the real deal that lives on the blockchain. Think of it as the official Pi Network amusement park, still under construction. These paper slips? Those are IOUs, initial offering units, and they're the fuel for a whole lot of speculation and, frankly, a bit of confusion. You can call IOU trading, a funhouse mirror for the real price. So, can an IOU price truly reflect the future value of the Pi coin? The answer is a resounding maybe. IOU prices are essentially hypothetical valuations based on a mix of factors, community excitement, project potential, and a generous dash of hopium. It's like trying to guess the weight of a birthday cake before it's even out of the oven. You might have a good idea based on the ingredients, but there's a chance it could be a dense, award-winning masterpiece or a lopsided, sugar-fueled disaster. The real question you should asking is how IOUs could, or couldn't, impact Pi after mainnet. Here's where things get interesting. When Pi finally launches its mainnet, the official opening of the Pi amusement park, the real price will be determined by the classic forces of supply and demand on actual cryptocurrency exchanges. The IOU price might influence early interest, but it won't magically translate into the real price. Think of it like the buzz around a new movie before it premieres. All that hype doesn't guarantee a box office smash. Should you use IOUs as a price prediction tool? Heck no. Absolutely not. IOU prices are a speculative roller coaster, not a crystal ball. They can be entertaining to watch, but don't base your Pi strategy solely on them. Instead, focus on the core elements of Pi Network, the technology powering it, the development team behind the scenes, and the strength of the community. These are the true indicators of Pi's potential for long term success. When the Pi Network coin was listed on IOU exchanges, it actually hit an all time high price, which I will call the $330 IOU dream. It's like reaching for the crypto stars, or maybe just crashing on the moon that $330 IOU high. It's enough to make any Pi pioneer's eyes widen. But before you start mentally designing your Pi funded mansion, remember this, take that number with a whole bag of salt. The real price of Pi after launch could be higher, lower, or somewhere in between. Predicting the crypto market is akin to predicting a toddler's tantrum, unpredictable and often messy. So, could Pi reach $330 in the future? It's possible, but it could take months, years, or even never happen. Remember, building a strong and valuable crypto ecosystem takes time, not just a few taps on your phone. Is the Great Pi sell-off, a blessing in disguise, maybe or maybe not? Now, let's talk about the potential Pi exodus. If a large number of pioneers decide to sell their Pi coins right after launch, it could cause an initial price dip due to the sudden increase in supply. But here's the twist. A healthy sell-off can actually be a good thing in the long run. It shows the coin is circulating, not just sitting stagnant in digital wallets. Plus, if Pi Network has a solid foundation, the price could rebound and even surpass the initial dip. In my opinion, I would say to be a savvy pioneer, not a blinded gambler. IOU trading is a distraction, a flashy sideshow while the main event, the mainnet launch, is still under construction. Don't get caught up in the hype and forget about the long-term vision of Pi Network. Do your own research, 
understand the inherent risks of cryptocurrency investing, yes, even PI, and remember, only invest what you can afford to lose. Now, go forth, PI pioneers. With the right knowledge and a healthy dose of caution, you can navigate the IOU maze and start minting your future, hopefully without getting fleeced in the process. Remember, the real PI adventure awaits on the mainnet, and it's up to you to decide if you're ready for the ride. If you are interested in getting more knowledge and setting yourself up for the best possible experience when the Pi Network launches, join my Telegram group and let's have a discussion. Learn more about cryptocurrency and cryptocurrency trading, this will help you as soon as the launch happens. Don't say I didn't inform you. My name is Tony, and this is Basic Knowledge. Till my next video. Keep mining.